actually. I'm high class. Yeah. I don't know where I grab this bit. Very easy, you see. Step one. And step two. Smoke show! Yeah. Breakfast. Breakfast. It's a nice top you got there, man. That's an that's an that's a new logo. It is. It's on the back. Ah oh, my boy. Look who's made it to Project Driver HQ. Me and Adam, were you here yesterday? No, we were here Ah, oh, so we both made it. So we today. What's up, Blake? Blake's, I made it. Here Blake's in garlic I'm bread. Glad he made it today. Joey's here. The man that makes our merch. The man, the myth, the legend. Yeah, he's going up. Yeah, exactly. I did the same thing. Um, it is very windy today. And unfortunately, I've got more sanding. What's up, Jojo? Hello, buddy. What's going on? Hello, everyone. Yeah. Hi, friends. Yeah, so unfortunately my mum's car ran into the back of my car with me being in control of the mum's car, so it was my fault. Um, I got a nice pearl of a dent here and here. And also the diffuser that me and Damn It Cam spent so much time sanding and painting literally last week is damaged here, here, here. And the bracket here to actually hold it onto the bumper is damaged. The bumper here has been all stuffed up because it's been like pushed in from here this is like where the number plate hit right there so it's a bit upsetting so what i'm going to do today is i'm going to pull the diffuser off i'm going to fix this part with some fiberglass and these parts here and we're going to repaint it today and hopefully get it back on the car which would be grouse don't know what I'm going to do about the bumper because it might be the actual like bracket to hold the bumper up that could be damaged. It could be the bumper that's damaged, but we'll get onto that later in today. And then whatever Blake's doing, Blake's doing me out of stuff. Adam's going to be the face behind the camera. Yeah, but yeah, so they pushed the bumper down a little bit, which is a bit upsetting. So, but as Blake said, it could just be the um, like little plastic brackets in there. Could be broken. Could be the bumper that's broken. Who knows? Uh, it's only fiberglass, so fiberglass is good and all. It's lightweight, but it's not all that strong when you hit it, I guess. Um, but we just got a little bit of little damage to go, and then we scuff it up and paint it again. Is that right, Blake? No, oh, give me some. Yeah, sounds a bit better. Alright, so I've been working, I've been sanding. Um, I got all that ready, I've scuffed the whole thing up. I might just go over it a little bit more with some scotchy where um, it's still very shiny until it goes dull. But, while I'm doing all that, Blake's gonna give me a hand in fiberglass 101. We went to Bunnings. Yeah, we got some, got some knives. Got some, some like 190 blades for like 9.95 or 5.95. Um, yeah, so I got a fiberglass this little hole up here. So I've just put some tape in there and some tape on the outside so it doesn't drip all over my thing because that would be really painful yeah. to get off. Oh yeah. Um, so we are literally just gonna like put. Do I have to scratch this up, bro? This paint. Maybe just go over it. Yeah, give it a give it a lick. So I'm gonna scratch it up and then we're just gonna like put one sheet, probably two sheets, and that's it. Bit yeah. of resin. Yeah. And that's it. Let it let it go off. Um and that's it. So it's not even gonna be that big, it'll be like half of that sheet. Probably not even probably a quarter of that sheet. Two times over. One, two. Job done. And then we'll drill a hole in it later. Then I can paint it and I did a little bit of work off camera, which is all over here. Yeah, I was doing a little bit of work. Sorry, my eye is really bad. I was doing a little bit of off-work camera. This is from last week. This is the front lip. This is the front lip that goes on Dopey. I've sanded it. You can see the rivet sitting out, but that's actually really flush with everything else. I'm not going to really worry about the bottom being like all nice and whatnot because I want to keep the rivets there for like strength. Um, and stuff so we're just gonna give that a paint when i paint the diffuser as well um and then we can wrap it and then if i get all that done today i'd be hysteric 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 isn't it 
If I can get all that done today, I'll be um, I'll be super happy. That's scary. It's getting really uncomfortable. So you actually. I'm not trying to. That's right, just sit it on there, let it stick, and then just soak it. Legitimately. That's done. That's another story we're never going to talk about. Bar's going to go back on now, everything's tight, everything's good, everything seems to be in shape. So now we're just going to throw everything back on and move on with the other mods yeah be able to continue there. and get away from the diffuser and how's that going you reckon it's dry touch it's dry. it dry. touch it, it. Looks don't good. stand on my headlights is it dry, it's dry. really it's really dry. really really yeah it's dry like it's fucking dry oh could you get the tongs out <laughs> 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 all right so yeah that's dry that's sort of dry all right let's get that front bar a uh, rear bar rear, rear bar that rear bar that one yeah drift bar drift bar yeah it actually is Look at him! Three-way high-five. Don't, we'll both fall. I was going to go through the gates. Gates head butt. Alright, so we fixed the diffuser. We are five glass a hole. We've just drilled a new hole. I've just put some black paint over the primer. And I'm going to do that at home during the week. So I can do it in my garage and get a good finish on it. And as well, then I can get this diffuser on the car tonight. And then it won't look so broken. Yeah, gang gang. Yeah, Reb, Rebel Ry Ryobi gang. We're doing something. It doesn't seem like we've been proactive today, but we have. Ah! Afternoon, Adam. Afternoon. How are you? Wonderful. Ah, uh, good, good, goody, good, good. Uh, I think this is going to be a um, an add-on for Paddy's diffuser fix video, which we did last week, so a week ago. But um, during the week, I've spent all my money getting parts to get the Miata running. Yeah. So, got some parts from MX5 Mania. Sydney boys, um, remember that little butt plug that we had? Well, this one actually is squishy. I'll measure it up against the other one I've got, which doesn't even flex. PCV valve, genuine, which is pretty cool. Um, and I've also got sparks and leads. Sparks and leads, that'll do. Also got them too. It smells like fart down here. Did you fart? No. No, I didn't. I genuinely didn't. You got a grin on your face. I've always got a grin on my face. What are you talking about? You farted. I didn't fart. If I farted, I'd be claiming that. You know this. <laughs> um, it's very windy outside at the moment, so audio is going to be terrible like last week when the audio fucked up. I'm going to get what I can, but apologies for the muffled noise as the wind produces. Windy stopped. Um, Alright, so... Spark plugs are coming out. Um, they're in there, all right. I just hope. Oh, they're tight. Oh, fuck. Give it the beans. Let's try this one. You want the beans? Yeah, we cracked it. Oh, that doesn't feel right at all. Why does it feel like I'm doing damage? It's still hard. What's burning? I was thinking of the same thing. That might explain the smoke. Yeah, something's on fire. Uh, yeah, it's very smoky out here. Yeah, very close. Something is on fire. Badly. 
It smells like eucalyptus. That is oily as fuck in there. Well, we knew this from last time. Yeah, didn't that much fucking oil. Oh, a bit of oil, man. <coughs> yeah, something's on fire. Bad. Someone must be whipping up a fucking mixtape. <sighs> That's fire. <laughs> See, I got new bung because I couldn't get the old one in. It's just new, you new, say, new bung. You might say it was a bit bunged. Old bung? Oh, bung no move. Nah, I Plastic. I could not get that in. I tried, I tried. I really did. So we've got a new one, and we also got a new PCV valve. Because this one's... Shake it. Just about fun. Yeah, and plus... So, got, because I can't really get the spark plugs out, we'll do this. Very easy, you see. Step one, and step two. Oh, I need that thing. Um, my pipe don't fit that big ass. I shouldn't make that noise. You should probably lube that up before you stick it in there, man. Look. Shove it in the bung! It's in. Yeah, it's not lube. Um, huh. I'm gonna have to probably take this back off. Ah, what else, man? You on that one? Yeah, you did. Get a lighter. Softens it up a bit. <clears throat> oh, or just muscle man it. Oh no. She just split it. Yeah. That's good. Rip. YouTube. Um, see how much do I need? Probably okay. about that. Hey, I got a tool for this. I forgot about it. Excuse. Oh. Probably razor blades. I don't know how that goes with a razor blade. Perfectly fine, thank you. Oh wait, we've seen oh, this before. Yeah. Look at that clean. Sorry. <laughs> clean. Cut. Do they it's alright, it's alright. Okay, update. Toaster's still here. Still doesn't have side skirts, but we're getting there. But it's still here. Don't stress. Mouta's not going to get all the love. He's, I mean, the Mouta is getting all the love, but the Golden Toaster will get love soon. Won't it? Yeah. I was just telling the people how the Golden Toaster is still here and it, 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 it is getting love soon. I still love her a yeah. lot. She, she gets driven every day. She does. She's she's the she's the race car daily. Cool bananas, it's on. Um, the only way I can think to get this out is like this. Look oh at that. God, why did that work? I was expecting Magneto to end up in the engine. Look at that. Let's have a look at this. Okay. I don't even know what cylinder this is. Maybe number two. Maybe. Mazda could be weird and make it number seven. But it's not too bad. It's a bit gunky. But surprisingly, not too bad. Wow. Iridiums? Not bad. Not bad. They work. But a bit gunky. Oh. Yeah, very gunky. Like. Feels like sandpaper, I feel like. Ooh. Let's get the rest of these out. Okay, bye. All right, we're back. Um, so we've got... We've got them out. Um, they're, all, they're all actually not bad, but they're pretty yucky. Especially like some of them that were submerged in oil. But that's all right, they can just go there. Um, Put some new pipes on this thing. I don't know what it's called, but that's the old one that came off at very how you going. This one wouldn't fit on there, and this one looks like a butthole. Butthole. I don't know if um vacuum line's gonna do it, but we're gonna try our best. Whoa, 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 whoa. 
No. Oh. And I gotta put some on this end too. But other than that, it should be all good. All right, so these are going in, some iridium. So I think that's what they came out of. Um, they don't really make laser platinums for this. I couldn't get laser platinums. But um, yeah, a little close up. Um, yeah, bit of that. Bit of that, bit gunky. So we've got brand newies. Uh, these are getting tightened down at like 15, 16 foot pound, I think, not very much. Yeah, it's still windy, it's getting cold. The smoke's all gone now, which is good. Adam was doing Adam things. Just... Try to grow a bigger turbo. <laughs> oh, hold up, before I do that, I'm going to... Do some of this so um because the rocker gasket leaked and went all in the holes there's still some oil in there so i'm going to wash it out with a little bit of this you don't want too much you don't, you don't want to fill the bores the pistons you don't want to fill that up the chambers no nah, that's the wrong word you don't want to fill it up you just want to put a little bit like this stuff does evaporate a little bit but um yeah you only want to put a little bit to wash the oil down that's in the spark plug galley holes um, so I'm going to put a little bit of that and maybe just wipe up whatever I can get out of there. Uh, I got the first two in. The boxes are getting flying. Bye. Um, With these, oh. there's a torque setting. I think I said that. I worked that out, just Googled it. Um, it's a bit hard because you just gotta, you don't wanna drop these, especially on this, because that's ceramic glass, because that'll break and then you fit. But we're dropping it. You just gotta yeet it in. Just yeet. Oh. Yeet. Well, it didn't sound like it went straight. Um, if you don't know what you're doing, don't do this because you might cross thread it, but if you know the feel, just go for it. If you know what you're doing. Like, Setting it. Yeah, it's going in its home, which is nice. They're actually pretty clean threads. Cleaner than the um, Subaru's threads when I did that last time. We've got one left. That I've just, I've just got in my pocket. For later. For later. Falafel. Faluba. <laughs> Bombs ahoy. Uh. Bloop. There we go. Cool. Next one. Go. Cool, they're all done. Spark plugs are in, boys. Can I get a hoorah? Hoorah! Uh, what I've got to do now, because I forgot, I've got to bolt this back on. I'll try and find, remember I fucked that bolt up, I'll try and find another one. If not, it should be able to go in. It's only just holding it there. And then, where's that other spark, that little spark plug got that I was telling you about? I don't know. But, I'll find it. <laughs> I've lost it. Okay, I've got the leads going on. Oh, that one don't want to go on. Just need some bit of oomph. Thing on. Oh! Alright, everything's back on, I think, if I remember. Car should be ready to start, hopefully. Everything goes well. There should be oil in there. Yeah. Not good oil, but there's oil. Um. Smoke show! Yeah. 
that'll happen because I put it all in the piston. Woo! Have a whiff of that. Yay! Have five. No. Do it again. Have five. No. <laughs> no leaking. Good boys, we did good.